Hi, I'm Chip Hanauer, and I'm a washed up old hydroplane driver. But before I drove real hydroplanes, I drove one of these. This is a bicycle hydroplane. You tie it behind your bike, tow it around the streets, and McClendon Hardware and Seafair has got a really cool thing going on. And we have Gail McClendon here. To t oh, wait, now do we have Gail McClendon? We've got Scott Carson, hey, president Chip. of Boeing Commercial Airplanes. How are Hi, you? Hi, Scott. How were you got there? Hey, I heard you guys were racing boats, so I brought one I built a long time ago with the 60th anniversary. What a great time to bring it out. So, Gail, McClendon's is going to make it easy for kids to build their own boats. Tell me about that. It's extremely easy, and we're hosting an event on June 20th. We're inviting parents to bring their children down to our McClendon's Renton location between 10 and noon to help us build these boats. Now, the good news is, after your boat is built, you can be in a drawing that's going to be held on July 10th to actually tow your boat behind your bike in the Alaska Airlines Torchlight Parade. Gil, these boats aren't that hard to build, are they? No, it's, it's really easy. Now, if people need help building the boat body, we will have people on staff to help build this piece, but the rest of it's simple. So again, if you don't get any of this, you can always go to seafair.com or mcclendons.com. You'll be able to get the pattern, the bill of materials, everything you need to know to build your boat. This is part of a grand tradition here in Seattle. I'll bet thousands of kids, Chip, have towed these bikes, these boats behind their bikes over the years. We did it all the time. Well, now, to have a boat and tow a boat behind your bicycle, you need to make motor noises, too, don't you, Chip? Well, there's two ways of doing that. You can either go, make your own motor sound, or what works really well is take a clothespin and a card, put it in your spokes. It sounds just like a Rolls-Royce Merlin engine. Now, Gail built this last night, and of course, it's a McClendon boat, and I don't understand why is yours Wahoo? Well, Miss Wahoo was Bill Boeing's boat in 1957. Oh, there It you seems go. appropriate that, that makes... we have Bill Boeing's boat. Well, I've got the Boeing boat. I have the Boeing boat because I'm going to drive the real You're Boeing the boat driver. at Seafair, and we're going to be running biofuel, so it's pretty exciting. You know, it looks like my boat's faster. I think mine's faster, and I had biofuel this morning, no, so I'm I think pretty... I'm ready to go. I'm mine's pretty... prettier. Well, that's true. Well, you know, there's, there's one way of settling this. Let's did, go race. Did you bring your bike? You bet. Did you bring your bike? Yes, I did. I brought my bike. Let's race. Let's race. So here's the rules. I win. You're going to talk or you're going to race? What's I'm ready to race. Right? Okay. On your mark, get set, go. Wait till I learn to ride a two-wheeler. I don't know if we have that much time, Chip. And the Boeing boat's ahead. Go figure that. Oh no, there she goes. Wait, we're talking and she's winning. Oh no, I'm losing control. I'm going outside. I can't hit the Boeing boat. <laughs> It'd be inappropriate. No fair. You've got Boeing engineering. It's a Boeing family boat. Whoa. Woo. <laughs>